So in today's video, I will be showing you guys how to do a hello updo, a traditional hairstyle per se. And I'll be leaving you guys with easy steps that will help you do it on your own without any mistakes. So if you're interested in knowing how to do this, this video is the movie for you and you need to keep watching. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Louis. If you're just seeing this face for the first time, hello, my name is Louis. Welcome to my channel. Please don't forget to subscribe before you leave and also don't forget to like my videos and turn on the notification bell so you always be notified whenever I post a video. So I'll be leaving some of my videos up here so you can go watch them and have some fun. So now I'm diving into why we're here. I'll be using the Kinky Straight extension for this hairstyle but if you have um, the regular attachment you can use it also so the both extension will give you the same look you're going for so now i'll be securing it down with my bobby pins on the part where i have it tied down So now I'm going to get the bobby pin again and get my hands and make it flat on that part and then use the bobby pins to secure it down. So I'm going to go over on the other side so it doesn't move when I'm trying to do the roll up. So I'll be working with this padding. I did a video sometime on how to do padding. So I'll be leaving it up there so you can go see how to make a padding. So now after that, I'm going to get my comb and then make the hair smooth. Then after that, I'm going to put the, the bun over and then use my bobby pins to hold it down and then go over and do the roll up method. So now I'm carefully rolling it up. Then after that, I'm going to just pull it backward carefully and then bend it to create the hollow shape. So now I'm going to use my bobby pins to hold it down. I'll be doing that to the both sides, but first I'm going to start with my right hand side. And then after that, I'll go over and do the left hand side. So up next, I'm going to like spread it. So as you can see here in the video, I am spreading it carefully because you wouldn't want all your hard work to be 
you know blown into thin air so you just have to spread it carefully then i'll go over with my rat tail comb and then make sure i push in all the flyaways and then get my hold spray to help it control all the flyaways so after that i'm going to use my poppy paints to like hold down all the parts that are puffy So now guys the opening right there is not a problem because i'll be treating the opening so i'll be using the braided mat i've done that in a video before i'll be leaving it up there so you can go watch how to do the braided mat so that's what we'll be using to cover the opening there So now i'll be using my ultra hold spray i know a lot of people have asked why do i always use the ultra hold spray in all my videos okay first of all guys it's very cheap and it's really easy to take out from a hair you can just you know comb the hair off and it goes out automatically without leaving any frits on the hair so that's why i like to use the ultra hold spray to or for all my videos here on this platform so now i have this cute little star crossed bead so i'll be using it to like embellish the hair so i'll be placing it you can just place anywhere you want to so whichever thing you feel is beautiful on the hair you can do so So guys the time has come we're about to cover up the opening so i have the braided mat already so i'm just going to put it right there and then get my beads and then put it around so i'm able to like cover up all my tracks
Hello everyone, thanks for joining me once again. I hope this video was really insightful and you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're yet to do that. And also, don't forget to leave the notification bell turned on so you always be notified whenever I post a video. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.